Big Screen, this wonderful free VR application where you can play games beside friends, lay down on your bed to watch a movie, join the worst karaoke of your life. Ready? Here we go. Or just chill with random people while listening to music in the background. Until this annoying audio problem comes up to ruin the vibes. It's always something like the last person who joined cannot hear your stream. Or maybe you switch to another game and the sound isn't working anymore. Whatever it is at the moment, it's about someone not hearing something. And you try every parameters, press the refresh audio button 20 times, follow every guide, but it just won't work. And when it does, it's only for a short period of time before it comes back to annoy you again. Now, hear me out. I'm not a big screen developer. Hell, even following their guide didn't fix it. But what if I told you that I came up with a solution that completely get rid of those issues? And once applied, doesn't require any changes ever. No more pressing this user's refresh button. No more switching to other sound devices. None of that. First of all, let's cover the basics. I recommend the PC version of Big Screen, not the watered down buggy version that is the remote desktop app. For Oculus users, you can find it on the Oculus Desktop app, link in the description. It's all free, and you'll need it anyway to connect to your PC via Link or AirLink, which additionally opens you the possibility to play PC VR games that usually look 10 times better than their standalone counterpart. Now, if you have something else than an Oculus, you can get Big Screen from the Steam Store as well as Steam VR in order to run it. Once inside the app, Click on the settings wheel and in the audio tab, if correctly installed, Big Screen Audio should display an install driver. If not, click install. A Windows prompt should pop up but won't display in VR headset. To validate it, either press left arrow on the keyboard and then press enter or remove your VR headset and do it with the mouse. This installation requires a restart of the computer. Once done, open the Windows search bar and type Sound Mixer Options. In the output list, check that Big Screen Audio Stream is there. Now, here comes the solution. When you cast on the Big Screen Audio Speaker, everyone on Big Screen can hear your stream correctly, except yourself. Problem we can solve by duplicating the audio to the speaker of your choice. You see, apps on Windows, unless you specify otherwise, plays and records sounds via the peripherals set as default. We are about to make it that, whenever you launch or quit VR, Windows automatically switch to the right ones. First, make sure all the apps use its default as the audio input and output. To do so, you can click on the reset button down on that sound mixer window. You might have to do it manually too for some of them where you have set up a specific device from inside the app. Once done, close everything related to VR and make sure that the peripherals that Windows claims as default are the one you use when outside of VR. For the people using SteamVR, connect your headset. You see, when you close SteamVR, it automatically set your default peripherals back to what it was. Therefore, half of the job is already done. All you need to do is to inform what it has to switch to when you want to play VR. To do so, click on the hamburger menu, settings, and in the audio tab, put Big Screen Audio Stream as the audio output device. Then activate the audio mirroring and set it to whatever speaker you use to hear VR. Also, set the audio input to the microphone you talk with while in VR. Now for Oculus. You can do the same by clicking on the desktop app, device, and then the image that represents your headset. In here, you should turn on Hear Computer Audio in VR. Bear in mind that in this case, the duplication is limited to the speaker of the VR headset, or whatever you connected to it via jack or Bluetooth. To automate the switching, you need to install Oculus Trade Tool. It's a useful piece of software that grants you a lot of control over the settings that revolve around VR. In the Service and Startup tab, tick Start Oculus Services when the tool starts, and Stop when tool exits. In the Tray Tool tab, untick Start with Windows, and toggle on Use Audio Switcher. Configure it to switch the audio and the microphone when Oculus Tray Tool starts and exits. On start, make both audios to big screen 
and the microphones to what you use to talk in VR. For the exit part, set the devices to what you use normally out of VR. For easy access, I highly recommend you to pin it to your taskbar and whenever you want to play VR, just launch it. Whenever you want to quit, close it.